Hey there, kids. It's me, Mr. Creepypasta. And um, you guys probably saw on Twitter that I mentioned I was looking for a way to do this because I've never done anything like this before. Uh, and I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys are here because you saw the word giveaway in the title of the video. So let me explain exactly what I'm doing. Um, first of all, uh, this is probably not going to mean a lot to you if you don't watch the channel. So, I mean, you'd have something, I'm sure, but I don't think it's going to mean that much if you... If you haven't been a part of the, the YouTube channel for a while. Um, but the, the main thing I wanted to talk to you guys about was this. Um, Hi there, kids. It's me, Mr. Creepypasta. This is awkward. Uh, <laughs> so I had a script before, and I didn't like it because it's really goofy, and I really felt I should talk to you guys candidly about this kind of stuff. Um, so, oh, uh, what I'm specifically talking to you guys about is this, mask. That's what the giveaway is. Uh, well, not, not this one. Uh, <laughs> not this one. This is actually uh, the very first mask I ever, I ever got. And I've been wearing it a lot more now, lately, uh, instead of wearing the other ones. Um, you can always tell, and I don't know if you guys can see this because the camera's kind of far, but um, there's like this scar right here. See, like it's open on the eye. There's this scar that's stitched up right there. And uh, this is always my first mask because my first convention I ever went to, I noticed that the eye hole was actually a little bit too big. It kind of still is. But I tried to fix it by stitching that up and create a little scar on the eye, which is why you'll see like some of the artwork has like a scar over MCP's eye is because of that. It's on the mask. Now, I miss the, the lore. Uh, <laughs> but these are the ones I wanted to talk to you guys about. These are what I'm giving away are my mask. And I mean, they are still my mask. These are all um, worn by me one time or another. You still see there's like ink spots on there. Um, they're a little bit worn, um, but I usually use them either on camera, I've used them before, or I've worn them at conventions. And my mom actually makes all of these for me. Um, so they're all hand stitched and they're all kind of made differently. Uh, they're not all the same because mom's been messing around with designs for forever, but nothing's really felt or been as good as my original mask, I don't think. Um, not to say, Mom, that's not to say that you have done bad on any of these masks. They were all wonderful. Uh, it's just that I loved the first one more than anything. I, I loved it because I thought that you you did such a great job putting this together. She actually made, like, a whole costume, like, originally that was supposed to have, like, bandage wraps and things like that. But I never got comfortable wearing it. I much prefer wearing stuff like the t-shirt and the, the green shirt and everything. I'm getting way off track. Um, <laughs> the reason I wanted to do the giveaway... Um, so it was last year that the YouTube demonetization thing really became a big problem. And uh, i that was the last time I spoke to you guys candidly, like, not like this, but it was my voice. That was the last time I spoke to you guys without being in character, without any real, like, mask on. And um, when the whole demonetization thing happened, I freaked out. I panicked um, because this is my life. Um, but it was you guys who came to the rescue for that. And I have been like in your debt. <laughs> and I, I always felt like the channel is in a way always trying to pay you guys back. And I don't mean just for that. I mean like all seven years that I've been doing this, I always felt like this, this isn't, a lot of YouTubers I talk to will always say like, it's your channel. You do what you want. You do what makes you happy. And like the being, being MCP doing this, this definitely makes me happy. This, this makes me beyond happy. But I, I, in a lot of ways, I don't always see it as it's my channel. This is your channel. This is about you. Uh, because I'm always trying to pay you guys back for that. I mean, we had a million subscribers a couple years ago. And those million subscribers aren't me. They're you. You guys are the million. You guys are the 1.4 million. You guys are the listeners on Spotify and, and on, on iTunes and stuff like that. You guys are the ones who support me on Patreon. You guys are the ones who sub. You guys are the, the what do you call yourselves now, the Insomniac Club on uh, on the, the live stream. That, that's you guys. And I mean, as much as I like the name Mr. Creepypasta, as much as I identify by a Mr. Creepypasta everywhere I am, everywhere I go. Yeah, I'm MCP, I'm Mr. Creepypasta. As much as I, as I love that name, that name isn't as much me as it is because of you. So, because it's, it's Christmas, or holidays, or however you want to view it, I want to give back to you guys. And I don't want to do something where it's like, oh yeah, I'm just going to give away Steam gift cards, or, or I'm going to give away something like that. I want to give away something that's actually something that you guys have, you guys have made the worth for. 
And I want to give away something that my actual subscribers and viewers and listeners would actually care about. So what I'm giving you guys are my old masks. <laughs> my old masks that my mom made and that I've worn. And that really do mean a lot to me. Because I think that you guys are the ones who actually gave them value. You're the ones who gave them worth. And you're, you're the ones who made these important. Um, so, how to, uh, how to win. How to win a mask. Um, if you guys take a look in the description down below. So, you guys have to scroll down. You have to click or tap on the little down arrow. And you got to see the link in the description. Uh, I, I asked on Twitter how to do a giveaway because I don't know. I've never done one before. Uh, some other people pointed out using Rafflecopter. And that seems to be the best way. It's not going to sell your information. Uh, so, we're using Rafflecopter to be able to do the whole drawing thing. Uh, so that way, you know, YouTube isn't associated, and it's not hosted by Google or anything like that. It's all just me. And on Rafflecopter, it's going to ask you for three things. One, you got to be following me on Twitter. That's the at Mr. Creepypasta and the number zero at the end of it, at Mr. Creepypasta zero. You have to make sure you're following because that's where I'm going to announce, hey, these are the guys that won. Then it's going to ask you for your email address. I need to know your email address because one, got to make sure that you're actually like, you know, 18 or older so you're able to win. So, you know, parents permission and such. You have to be 18 to be able to win and I got to be able to contact you. So that's what your email address is for. So I can contact you, let you know that you won and you can tell me where to send your mask to. And the last thing it's going to ask you is what your YouTube username is, because this is the big part, guys. This is this right here, kids, is really what I want from you. Comment down below. That's my mask. Because I'm the guy who wears them. You're the guys who are that mask. So comment. That's my mask. And on the raffle copter, it's going to ask you what your YouTube username is so I can look you up and make sure you actually did comment because I want to double check. You're not just going to be able to go in there, type out a raffle copter, or type out like a billion different raffle copters with every single thing that you've done. I will see, I will see it, and I will be able to double check and make sure you actually did comment on this video. So those are the rules. Those are the three things I need from you in that link in the description down below on the raffle copter. And guys, uh, I wish I had like a million. I well, I guess I, I wish I had 1.4 million of these that I could be able to give away to all of you. Um, but obviously I can't, and obviously I can't just trace where you live, so, um, thank you. And I don't think there's a better way for me to be able to say that besides thank you and dedicating my life to doing this, because if I wasn't doing this, if it wasn't because of you guys being interested in this or enjoying listening to this or watching this, I'd be, God knows where I'd be. But I wouldn't be married. I wouldn't have Herc. I wouldn't have the friends I have today. I wouldn't have you. So Merry Christmas, everyone. Happy holidays if you don't celebrate Christmas. <laughs> and um, thank you. Hey there, kids. It's me, Mr. Creepypasta, and I wanted to tell you all thank you so much for listening to tonight's story, or watching tonight's story if you're on YouTube. If you're not on YouTube, that means you're probably on the podcast that's available on iTunes, on the Google Play Store, and is now actually available on Spotify and doesn't use as much data. So, hey, that's a thing. If you guys aren't listening on YouTube or Spotify, then I have no idea how else you could have found me. Unless you found one of those books on Amazon. You know, the Creepypasta Collection, Volume 1, Volume 2. Those are things, too. Oh, well. I don't know how you would have heard me there, seeing as this was recorded, like, two years after those came out. Uh, well, anyway. Thanks for listening, folks. And sweet dreams. <laughs>